I just realized one of my videos was going to be out of focus. It was the previous one, I believe. Whoops. I just wanted to bring up my books. They are friendship journals. Each of them have different and unique questions, and they are structured in a certain way to be able to deepen your relationship with a friend, with a spouse, with a family member, anybody. Um, so questions and also um, a couple of activities and they're just kind of fun and then you can keep them around and be able to have those answers to be able to look back on um, the link is in the description below so with the estp their function stack is extroverted sensing introverted thinking extroverted feeling and introverted intuition and so when they're at their prime they are utilizing their first two functions um, which is extroverted sensing and introverted thinking and so with all of the different stimulus that they're getting from their exterior world, it's filtered through their um, introverted thinking function, which helps them to figure out connections and self-reflect and know kind of like what to do and, and be analytical about all the situations around them. But when they're finding themselves in a place of pressure, they start to utilize their extroverted feeling function with their extroverted sensing function. And so when that happens, when you're entering into any kind of loop, you start obsessing over something. Uh, the loop itself is not a bad thing because it's filtering a new way to look at things and it might bring some clarity. But if you get stuck, like I said, you get obsessed with things and we need to help each other get get out of those loops. So with the ESTP, um, the things that they start obsessing with are their connections and relationships around them and they want to appease and please them as well as seeking validation from them. When they are in this loop, they're actually shaking up what they know is normal and I believe they're trying to actually figure out a new structure or a new way to be able to do things and they're going to people closest to them because they're trying to figure out what they need to do, what is the best thing they need to do and they really start to lean in to their input when normally when they're using their introverted thinking um, they can actually come up with those on their own and they actually feel rather confident in doing that normally but when they lose that sense of confidence they want to be guided by people that are closest to them that they really trust so something that they can do is just to pull back do a puzzle do little things that stimulate their introverted thinking uh, math or reading, also doing some research on a topic they really enjoy, or even hanging out with a TI dominant, which would be like an INTP, to help them pull back to that space to be able to think through things and to be confident in their own analysis. But it is critical to also remember to address the thing that is pushing you into your loop. Yeah, because if you just do this, but are never actually coming face to face with what's pushing you in, then it's not going to help you at all. So I hope that is something that is valuable. If you're an ESTP, I would love to hear your experiences down below in the section of the comments. And I'm just gonna end on my friendship journals. I hope you guys um, find these to be useful. And if you do use them, I'd love to hear your experiences with them. And they're gonna be in the description below for a purchase. So I will see you guys in another video, another life, you never know. I like smelling microphones. Cause I just know later it's just gonna sound weird. Bye. <laughs>